Here with Max Siegel, the owner of Rev Racing, huge part of this uh, NASCAR Drive for Diversity Combine here. Uh, what kind of things have you noticed today? Has anything really stood out to you so far? Uh, one of the things is that each year the drivers get better and the talent pool gets deeper. Uh, so we got some really exciting young talent out there on the track that are very knowledgeable and uh, I'm just excited about picking the drivers for this year's class. One of the things I notice out here with some of these drivers as they walk around is I notice a lot of maturity uh, with the you know, I heard uh, one of the drivers here talking about how she need, where she need, where she's already learned she needs to improve, and it seems like the drivers here realize what they've got to do. Uh, is that one of the things that, as an owner, you like to see? Yeah, it's amazing because uh, each year as the talent pool gets deeper, the drivers also get younger, but they do have a lot of maturity, have a high racing IQ uh, and knowledge of the car. So just listening to them on the radio uh, tells me that they are really trying to get better at what they do. And looking ahead to next year, obviously on the late model side, it was kind of a, kind of a rough season, a lot of bad luck out here. Uh, what do you I mean? What do you look forward to for next season? Yeah, we'll continue to provide uh, great equipment, and a part of the process, you know, is is developing and, and pushing through adversity. And as you know, it's about being persistent and resilient. And so we're looking forward to, you know, continuing to watch the drivers evolve and and have a hopefully a much better season this year. And you look at some of the previous drivers who've raced for you now. You know, names like Daryl Walls, and you got Kyle Larson up there, who's looking like he's going to be a Cup superstar. Uh, What's that mean to you to look to look back at those guys now? Uh, we're very proud of them. I mean, watching Kyle and Daryl on a weekly basis in the National Touring Series has been great. Seeing Ryan Gifford have a nationwide start uh, just really, to me, validates the model that we have and excited to be able to provide the platform for these young drivers to go on to successful careers. All right, thanks. Thank you.